Nani Kids. Come with me. Here we learn everything. Welcome to Nani Kids. Hi, my dear children. In Nani Kids, today we are going to learn about time conversions. What is meant by time conversions? The conversion table of time is necessary tool for various mathematical calculations. It is most important thing. Time conversion is two different units of time. The smaller units are seconds, minutes and hours. The bigger units are days, weeks, months and years. We use seconds, minutes, hours to tell the time of the day and as well as days, weeks, months, years to tell the date. Come children, let's go on learn it briefly about time conversion. The first unit of time is seconds. Seconds Sixty seconds is equal to one minute For one minute there are sixty seconds Children, three thousand six hundred seconds is equal to one hour Per hour we have three thousand six hundred seconds 86,400 seconds is equal to one day. That is, we have for a day 86,400 seconds. And the next unit is minutes. Minutes. 60 minutes is equal to one hour. Per hour, we have 60 minutes. 1440 minutes is equal to 1 day. For a day, we have 1440 minutes. And the next unit is hours. Hours. 24 hours is equal to 1 day. 24 hours is equal to 1 day. 168 hours is equal to 1 week. Children, that is 168 hours is equal to 1 week. And the next unit, bigger unit is days. Days. Seven days is equal to one week. For a week, we have seven days. Thirty days are thirty one days is equal to one month. Thirty days are thirty one days is equal to one month. Next. 365 days is equal to 1 year. 365 days is equal to 1 year. And the next bigger unit is weeks. Weeks. 4 weeks is equal to 1 month. For a month, we have Four weeks. Fifty two weeks is equal to one year. That is the whole year we have fifty two weeks. And the next bigger unit is months. Months. 12 months is equal to 1 year. 
per year we have twelve months. That is January to December. And the next bigger unit is years. Years. Ten years is equal to one decade. Ten years is equal to one decade. Hundred years is equal to one century. Hundred years is one century. And at last, thousand years is equal to one millennium. Thousand years is one millennium. Yes, children. Let's say again. I will say time conversions. Smaller units and bigger units. Smaller units is seconds, minutes, hours, and the bigger units is days, weeks, months, and years. I will repeat it again. Listen carefully, children. Seconds, sixty seconds is equal to one minute. Three thousand six hundred seconds is equal to one hour. Eighty-six thousand four hundred seconds is equal to one day, and the next smaller unit is minutes. Sixty minutes is equal to one hour. Thousand four hundred and forty minutes is equal to one day, and the next smaller units is hours. Twenty-four hours is equal to one day. Hundred and sixty-eight hours is equal to one week. These are the smaller units of time. It is used to calculate the time. And the next bigger units of time is day. Seven days is equal to one week. Thirty days or thirty-one days is equal to one month. Then three sixty-five days is equal to one year. Next. The bigger unit is weeks. Four weeks is equal to one month. Fifty-two weeks is equal to one year. And next. Months. Twelve months is equal to one year. Twelve months is equal to one year. And at last, years. Ten years is equal to one decade. Ten years is equal to one decade. 
Hundred years is equal to one century. Hundred years is one century. Thousand years is equal to one millennium. Thousand years is one millennium. These are the bigger units of time, and it is used to tell the date. Yes, children. I hope now you all understood the time conversion. That is smaller units of time and the bigger units of time. Thank you, children. Let's see in the next video.